she wants to send a message clear to the india block alliance that you know when it comes to the state assembly polls in 2026 in west bengal she will not be willing to you know go for any kind of seat sharing with her india alliance partners which is the congress and the cpm hello and welcome to the indian express a few days ago trinamool leader mamata banerji uh, at a rally announced that she she will provide outside support to the india alliance if it comes to power india jot ke netritto diye baire theke sob rokom sahajjo kore amra sarkar gothon kore debo jate banglay amar ma boner kono din oshubidhe na hoy amar 100 diner kaaje kono din oshubidhe na hoy yesterday at a rally in uh, tamlok she stated that she is very much a part of the india alliance and people have misunderstood her statement all india level e oneke amay bhul bujheche ami bolechi banglay kono jot nei kintu india e je jot ta ota ami toiri korechilam oi jot ta diye amra sarkar toiri korbo amra jote thakbo jote achi amra yeah which means she is an insider in the india alliance now this see saw in stance seems to be a uh, very characteristic of mamata banerji i have got with me um uh, shantanu choudhury who ha- has reported on this shantanu is a uh, is a kolkata correspondent of indian express shantanu what exactly is going on in mamata's mind well uh, uh... on wednesday she said that you know she would provide outside support to the india block alliance and uh, she said that you know uh, uh, that alliance should not include any leaders from the west bengal congress or the cpim tai jene rakhe din india jot ekhar kar bangla cpim congress ke dhorben na o dutu amader sathe nei o dutu bjp er sathe ache ami dillir kotha bolchi Uh, because we know that you know since last two years mamta banerji had tried to stitch together an opposition alliance she had traveled to uttar pradesh maharashtra and delhi multiple times to you know forge an opposition unity against the bjp led government at the center and later on that had culminated in the formation of the india block alliance and mamta banerji in her election rallies had claimed that you know she had given the india name and she was instrumental in you know you know forging this alliance of all the anti bjp parties uh, for the lok sabha polls however you know uh, since the lok sabha uh, uh, notification was issued mamta banerji had be has been you know keeping distance from the india block alliance she had said that you no know, her party will go all alone in west bengal and she categorically said that there is no india block alliance in west bengal but she will you know uh, look at it at the national level later on uh, what she meant was later on means then after the lok sabha uh, results are announced and now surprisingly after you know ma- maintaining distance from the you know india block alliance for so long and she you know two days back said that that she will provide an outside support to the india block alliance and now this 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 kind of a statement has you know caught everyone by surprise because uh, you know everybody wanted to know what does she mean by providing an outside support to the government because either you join the government or you the, you don't join the government so the so the political analyst said that you know by you know saying that she will give an outside support means that she wants to send a message clear to the india block alliance that you know when it comes to the state assembly polls in 2026 in west bengal she will not be willing to you know go for any kind of seat sharing with her india alliance partners which is the congress and the cpm because she wants to go all along in west bengal so there was this you know kind of a uh, uh, uh and, and and we've seen that you know congress leaders you know like adiranjan choudhury and also cpm secretary and uh, general secretary sitaram yechudi has also you know criticized mamta banerji uh, for maintaining the double standards and for maintaining uh, for opening both doors open in case the india block alliance doesn't come uh, doesn't form a government she might you know go to the bjp so after facing the criticism from the cpm and the congress she has backtracked yesterday in tamluk she said that she is very pu- much part of the india alliance and you no know, she will definitely you know support it if it's in a position to form a government at the center after the lok sabha polls exactly uh, now uh, you know staying on to that um, in the rally in tamlok she stated that you know she is as you said she is very much part of the india alliance but she wanted to make distinction between uh, the alliance in the national level and in the local level and she stated that in um, bengal uh, 
uh, you know, be, both us, uh, like, you know, they are with BGP. So what exactly was that statement? Like, you know, if you could clarify that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, because you know, Mamta Banerjee uh, always wanted to you know, contest alone in West Bengal in all for the two series, and therefore she thought that you know, the BJ, uh, the CPIM and the Congress, which are part of the bigger alliance, would you know give support to her, and they won't you know uh, contest the election in that in that manner. And she initially wanted to give two seats to the Congress, which the Congress had won in 2019, like the Berampur, Adit Chaudhary seat, and also the Malda South, Malda Dakshin. So therefore, the Congress wasn't happy with this kind of and seat sharing adjustment, and they wanted more seats from the TNC, and that's how the the alliance didn't take place in West Bengal. And she had already, you know, clarified that you know her party will in no way will have an alliance or the seat sharing adjustment with the CPIM, which which you know TNC came to power by you know ousting the 34 years of left-wing government, and she considers CPM as to be her the real opposition. Uh, despite BJP, you know, uh, actually uh, gaining a lot of ground in West Bengal. So therefore, she cannot have any kind of, you know, electoral understanding with the CPIM. And she had made that clear uh, at the early uh, early stage. Uh, therefore, you know, uh, as the, the uh, switch sharing uh, adjustment with the Congress didn't work out in West Bengal, uh, she announced that she will go all alone in, uh, in West Bengal. Now, you know, after, you know, uh, the completion of the four phase of the elections and there is a kind of uh, 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 report going on uh, or the India Bloc Alliance leaders are saying that the BJP is yet to get the kind of majority that it was seeking out of this. Uh, first four elections. So therefore, there is a chance that in opposition parties may be in a position to form a government. So after seeing this kind of reports, so Mamta Banerjee is trying to you know see whether there is an option of again re-enter into the alliance and you know position herself as the leader uh, who can who can help the opposition parties form a government at the center. Uh, therefore, this is the kind of uh, 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 kind of a message that she wanted to send. However, the opposition parties have also you know, pointed out that uh, you know, by by saying outside support, she is also you know uh, sending another message to the BJP also that you know I am not officially joining the party. So in case the opposition parties fail to form a government, then you know the, if the BJP is in the power uh, and needs you know, some parties not going to the uh, India Bloc Alliance, then the TMC might you know uh, give that kind of support to the BJP also. That is what the opposition has alleged against the Mamta Banerjee. Uh, however, you know, uh, as you know, uh, the more election phases are uh, coming, so therefore the TMC, you know, trying to you know trying to test the waters before going uh, full throttle for the after the Lok Sabha poll election results are announced. And how has opposition leaders reacted? You also, I mean, you mentioned uh, Adhir Ranjan Chaudhary, who said that you know Mamata is like you know is an opportunist and she's now. Uh, she could be aligned to BJP too. Uh, and then uh, we have also spoken to some party insiders who claim, who said that, you know, uh, this is a, a message that she is sending out to uh, a lot yeah. BJP, as you said, pointed out. So what, what are the like you know, reactions like? Well, State Congress President Adit Chaudhuri is a fierce critic of Mamta Banerjee, and she and he never supported Mamta Banerjee's kind of politics or the kind of way uh, her party has decimated Congress in West Bengal. She has always he has always opposed the idea of having an, any kind of an electoral understanding with the TMC in West Bengal, and uh, therefore he sees Mamta Banerjee as an opportunist. Uh, he sees Mamta Banerjee of lying uh, to the you know, to the other parties. Uh, he sees that you know Mamta Banerjee is trying to maintain double standard. It's like she wants to keep both of her doors open in case the uh, you know, India Bloc Alliance fails to uh, you know uh, form a government at the center. She might switch uh, to the BJP because you know her track record also you know says that because she was previously with the Atal Bihari Bajpayee government and she had supported that government and therefore the Congress you know doesn't trust her blindly at least the West Bengal Congress doesn't trust her and that's the kind of sentiment that has been you know, uh, uh, you know reciprocated by the state president uh, Adit Chaudhuri and CPM also and the other hand has also criticized Mamta Banerjee for uh, for maintaining a double standard and for also keeping her door open because her policy is not clear by 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 saying that you know outside support she is not you know making herself clear whether she is a, a part of the alliance or she is still testing the waters and she is still waiting for the looks of election results to come out so therefore there is no clarity either you are in or either you are out that's the kind of a uh, 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 statement. Uh, that were that that the opposition parties were waiting. Uh, but however, you know, 
also she backtracked from that and she said that she is part of the opposition now it has to be seen how the opposition is you know taking this statement so whether they <laughs> they show any faith on her or they are still apprehensive about her you know uh, coming to the india block alliance that is yet to be seen uh and this statement this comes uh, a week after bjp accusing mamata of wanting a weak uh, uh government in the center uh and uh, uh, and also shubhendra adhikari actually laughed off mamata's claims of playing a decisive role in the government in center so if you could uh, you know elaborate on that yes no uh, because uh... the bjp national president jp nadda recently campaigned in west bengal and he repeatedly accused mamta banerjee of trying to have a government at the center which is weak uh, he said that the opposition parties or the tmc want a majboor sarkar at the center then a majboor sarkar a stable government which the country needs which the people of the country want however mamta banerjee after seeing this kind of a uh, you know a uh, uh, kind of an attack from the bjp she tried to you know position herself as someone who doesn't want a weak government at the center therefore she tried to project herself to be a party which wants for the uh, for the development of the country and which wants to uh, uh, wants to stay with a party which is at the power at the center so therefore she said that we will give outside support that means that you know she will support the government which will be formed after the 2014 so therefore uh, this is the kind of you know uh, message that she wanted to send after you no know, receiving criticism for the bjp that she wants a weak government at the center is she in is she out uh, yeah, well only time will tell uh, as of now we will uh, i take her word for it and believe that she is actually a, a very much a part of the india alliance thank you for joining um, us for this conversation shantanu uh, for more such uh, analysis videos keep on watching the indian express youtube channel do subscribe to us thank you